blood stem cells on a bulldog with a tasha and as an alternative to genic stem cells used in genetic illnesses. Diesel is Chiara's three-year-old bulldog who suddenly shows symptoms of locomotor attacha. The cause was unknown. Trauma or something else? After 15 days of antibiotic and cortisone, he still has difficulty maintaining balance and working normally. An MRI was rightly suggested with probably surgery, but bulldogs are very delicate and Chiara, who knew well the positive effects of stem cells from previous experience, decided to try our regenerative therapy first. She brought Diesel to my house, where I inoculated him locally and by EV with allogenic stem cells, that is from another dog, and here he is 20 days later. Diesel, 20 days after stem cell treatment, still has difficulty climbing the garden steps. Because his chronic keratitis improved in this period, I decided to repeat allogenic stem cells on his spine integrated by subconjunctival inoculation. Diesel begins to open his eye after 20 days. Here he is in 50 days after stem cells treatment. 50 days after the first inoculation, Diesel works normally. Even the chronic immunomediated keratitis has improved and Chiara says he has never been better. Diesel's bloodshot eye has improved 50 days after first stem inoculation. Diesel is also able to keep his eye open after 50 days. In this case, we use stem cells from another dog. We can do this because these cells have no passport. In fact, no side effects were shown even if they are injected consecutively for 10 days from the same donor to the same receiver. The allogenic stem cells inoculation experimented on dogs, horses and cats with non-provoked pathologies are now about 10,000 and some receivers has been injected many times a year for many years. The stem cells used have a normal genetic patrimony, therefore they can be used as an alternative to genic stem cells, which are hemopoietic stem cells, from an ill subject missing a gene, that are enriched with a healthy gene carried in a, vir in a virus as used in the therapy given by the medical staff of San Rafaele Hospital in the treatment of Wiscott Eldritch Syndrome and Metachromatic Leucodystrophia, published in Nature. But the extraordinary work of the Italian doctors may have side effects in fact, the FDA recommends a longer observation period for patients 
being treated with a genic therapy protocol give, given that in 1999 an 18-year-old American boy died after developing a serious immune reaction to the adenovirus used as the gene carrier and in the 2003 a French child undergoing genic therapy developed leukemia. In Diesel's case we were not dealing with a genetic problem but five years ago together with Ghent and Tor Vergata universities I proposed a preventative treatment study on canine degenerative myelopathy that has the same genetic mutation as lateral amyotrophic sclerosis. The project was refused even though it was received favorably by international referees. You can read their opinions in my latest book Blood-Derived Stem Cell www.edizionialtea.it What does this mean? With half a liter of blood from a healthy donor one can prepare thousands of stem cell doses with healthy genetic patrimony a real drug to experiment with the prevention of an unmanifested genetic pathology without causing side effect and with production cost infinitely lower than current genic therapy. My therapeutic system comes from the close contact between research and its application. The research applied on non-provoked pathologies in laboratory animals often remains sterile. In fact, the stem cell research done by the Nobel Prize Yamanaka has no therapeutic applications. Instead, the idea is explained on my YouTube channel Blood Stem Cells How and Why They Function comes from a practicing veterinary who wanted to obtain a quick result without side effect effects in this field through a new research system without blinkers and barriers. Naturally, the time needed for the experimental phase in human medicine must be respected. Up to now, this project has been financed by a few people who believed in me and my results and Fondazione Roma Terzo Settore, but without further funds we must suspend this experimental trial that will radically change the health of mankind. Therefore, I ask you to help our no-profit association.